Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Okay, good. Just wanted to do some sound checks. But... Just wanted to welcome everyone on in. I'm John Moody of uh, Moody Mystery. Um, I'm going to continue playing the uh, Wizardry 7 uh, D Forte mod. Um, so what we're going to do, we're going to... This is episode 3. Uh, last episode, we, um, we actually were in what we call the Beginner Dungeon. If you remember, the Beginner Dungeon has has a cool fountain where you can pretty much heal yourself ad nauseum. Um, actually, it would be funny if it were a poison fountain and you can call it ad nauseum. Ha ha ha. But, um, so we were actually in the middle of exploring it, so let's get back to our exploration. Okay, this, this actually used to be copy protection. So one thing you actually had to know, you pretty much had to look up the manual to see, well, what is the, you know, sixth word. Now it's, it's been disabled, fortunately, but still. Okay. Going to load it, and let's, let's look at our map. Remember, this is a one-character run. Okay, so we have our parchment. And the old parchment reads, If you don't want to lose it, cover it with Palookis. Palookis Armory, Mail and Fine Leathers, located in New City. Okay. It's actually going to be important, believe it or not. But let's, let's, let's look at our map. Okay, so it looks like we haven't explored this entire area, so we're gonna we're gonna go north. Okay, and I'm trying to see did we get did, did we explore the area going south? Did we did we do that? I don't know if we did. Nope. So we're gonna do that. Okay. I know we, I'm pretty sure we did not explore this area, so. Hmm, surprise. Usually we get a, usually we get an encounter there. We didn't. Interesting. Now one thing you notice is that the map is, does not show the, is not showing the doors. And so how it works. If we go to our mapping scale, our mapping scale is 17. So, if let's say your mapping is 0, you can't even see walls. I think it's about 10 where you start seeing walls. But you need to get your mapping scale up to about, I'd say about 30 before you start seeing do um, doors. Right now, we're not worried about that. We're concentrating on our theology. Being that we are a priest, really. Okay, must have accidentally hit the spell button. Okay. I, I like to do... Okay. So whenever you hear that sound, that means you're going to have an encounter of some kind. Now keep in mind, not all encounters are necessarily bad, okay? Um, you know, so for example, it could be I mean, a uh, hostile, it could be an NPC counter, for example. Okay. Uh, let's see. I really do want to get a, sec uh, a good weapon. Okay, so we're going after the blackbirds. Um, one of them flew away. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna keep going. We're gonna hit it again. Ooh, good ten. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna, we're gonna keep hiding. 
right? You're always That's the key to these games. You always want to hide. You always you always want to you know, you know that, that's why I started out with a bard. Bards do have the ability to hide. And as you can see above the Y, you see that I have the shadow icon, which means I'm still hidden. So we're going to have some fun. Probably didn't get a lot of experience. Darn. Okay, let's, let's get back to our... Ah, we need about 32,000 for the next uh, level up. Okay. Let's see. I think we're done with this area here. Let me check. Yeah, uh, yep. Pretty much are. So we're just going to leave. Let's see what's next. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the fountain, you know. Nothing wrong with um, some good, just good old fashioned healing. You know, good old fashioned healing and whatnot. Oh, yeah, I remember this is where I dropped some of my things. And again, the reason for that is because, again, One, one thing I've done, I've, I've watched lots of other streamers um, on these types of RPGs, and the main thing I keep hearing about is carrying capacity. You know, in inventory management. I, I'd say inventory management. Okay, so what I'm going to do here, I think this is where I use my old gate key. Yep. And there is a... Ooh. Okay, we got four bugs, so we're just gonna... We're, again, we're always we're gonna hide. We're gonna save our spells. We're not gonna... We're not gonna use the spells right away. We're just gonna try to keep... hide okay we got some three we got three bitter bugs y'all I don't know why the bugs are bitter okay probably probably one of them found that their significant other was cheating on them and you know what so tell you what they make the in most interesting sounds, I must say, though. Okay, we got one. Okay, we're gonna again hide back in. Why do we keep thrusting? I think because bash is related to our strength. And we don't have a lot of strength. Where our strength is only at seven. Okay. I'm looking to see if there's any, don't see any secret doors. So now we're going to go down to level two. So now we're in level two of the, the beginner dungeon. That's what, that's what I call this. The game call, you know, calls it that too. Okay. And you do want to save. You do want to save somewhat often, because ah, another encounter. Let's see what we get here. Five creeping cruds. I'm not a big fan of them because they can breathe, and they they can sometimes breathe pretty heavy. And even if we are hidden, we could still get hit with a breath weapon. OK, 
Okay, but they, they don't have a lot of hit points, which is the good thing. Ooh, what am I bit? Okay, so we're down to four. Now, the thing we have to keep in mind is when we're on the second level here, the monsters... Monsters, from if I remember, tend to tend to be a little bit tougher, which is bad and good because we also do get a little bit more XP. Nothing wrong with a little bit extra XP. Okay, nicely done. Okay, so here we're gonna move on. Okay, I'm going to keep on going. Okay, so we're going to, and usually what happens when you enter a room, that's often when the encounters take place. So here we go, let's enter the room. Okay, we got some bugs here. Hello, bugs. Now we're gonna we're gonna use the trick here of resting. Keep keep in mind that um, when you're um, in this game, when you're hidden, you know you can still get attacked by either breath or spells. But I know these bugs can't do either, so I'm just going to re rest up my stamina here. It's a dirty little trick, but someone's got to do it. But honestly, if you're going to do a single character run, you probably have, you know... You really need a character that can hide. Otherwise, I'll be honest with you, I think I tried it one time with a character that could not hide. This was in the vanilla mode, and it did not, let's just say it did not go well. Okay. Now, one thing we could do if we wanted is if anyone if, if anyone remembers South Park make love not Warcraft you know if we really wanted to be safe we could just like stay in the beginner dungeon all day and but let's just say leveling up is gonna take a long time also we also we don't have access to the sword of a thousand truths so you know that's that's another thing Okay. Try to remember which way I wanted to go in. Let's okay, let's go let's go this way. There is an ad break coming up soon, so I'm going to um, pause a little bit.
Um, how I do ad breaks is I usually use them as a chance for uh, for people to maybe take a bathroom break. Maybe you could, you know, do this, do that. You know, do what not. Okay, I'm gonna, there's an ad break going on, so I'm gonna BRB. Well, I'm getting conflicting messages. Well, I have one thing saying that my ad break is over, but I have another thing saying that, oh no, it's still continuing. So I'm going to be like, okay, so I'm in this fight with some bugs, two groups of bugs. Okay, ooh, I managed to stay hidden, so I'm going to take advantage of that. Okay, still hidden. Okay, let's hide. Let's go back into hiding, y'all. Time to go back into hiding. Okay, nicely done, Moody. Yay! Hello, bugs. So let's keep on battling these bugs. Again, we're using the hide, um, the hide, the hide technique to um, um, hide, you know, so that's what we have to do. We have to do that. We have to hide. Come on, bitter bugs, bitter bugs, bitter bugs. like the third encounter in this room. Darn it. Wow. Holy shnikes. Oh crap. We're getting, we're getting hit pretty good too. Oh. Ooh. These are boring beetles. Okay. Well, what I'm going to probably do, I'm not, I don't really, let's see. I'm going to whirlwind them. I'm going to see if I can at least, 
kill a few of them. You know, or at least weaken them. Okay, I hit four of them. Probably gonna heal. I'm probably gonna heal some. I'm gonna, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna heal myself one, one hit point at a time. That's gonna get me some good training because every time you cast a spell, I think unless you're unless you're an alchemist or um, unless you're using all, um, unless you're an alchemist, you actually will get some. Uh, you actually will get some. Uh, uh, some oratory training, and that's what I'm going for. I'm trying to get some oratory training by casting spells. Okay. Let's see. Do we have anything? Okay, try to remember what does the loot of iron. S okay. Okay, ah, so we're protecting myself. Now, you may wonder why I'm why I'm a priest, why I can why I can still use use instruments because I at least have a point in music. I've, I've gotten me a point in music, so I can at least uh, play instruments, even though I'm now a priest. Okay, so let's let's um let's start going after. Ooh. Okay, we're down to four, so that's not as bad. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can't maybe knock one or two more of them out. Okay, that's good. And we're still hidden, so that's a good thing. Oh, crap, darn. Ooh. Ooh, seven. Okay, we're we're getting we're getting in a bit of trouble here. Getting in a bit of trouble. At least the good part is we're we're at least we're hiding much more we're succeeding in hiding. Pretty much on a regular basis. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna, I'm just going to, you know, chill for a little bit. Just gonna rest. I, I need to regain some stamina. This is one way to do it. There's actually a few spells you can cast. There's a stamina spell you can cast. I don't know if I've gotten it yet. And I also don't think the boring beetles go away. Let me just try something. Nope. At some point, what I probably should do, I probably should... I probably should, you know, get maybe get, get me some po... you know, get me some potions, uh, get me some books. Ah, let's talk about books. What are books? They books ha contain spells. Um, spells. So what happens? Let's say I already have the spell bless, but let's say I didn't, and I got a book of bless. What I could do, I could scribe that into my spell. I could scribe that, and then I'd be able to cast the spell bless. So that's a way to learn new spells because um, how spells work, you do get, I think, one spell per level up um, that you can choose, but if you want to get spells quicker, books are the way to go. And one thing I will say about the D Forte mod is there there's a much greater variety of books. Okay, these boring beetles are... And if you're like, Moody, you're boring for just resting, I'm, just, I'm trying to survive. I don't want to... 
I don't want to have to, like, you know, go move my death counter up by one. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. So I'm going to finally go after that. So I'm, I'm getting some bad luck. Because I keep getting, I keep hitting them, but I don't penetrate. So I have a feeling these boring beetles have a, have a tougher armor class. So. Okay, good. Okay, so we're down to two. That's 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 an improvement. That's an improvement. Good. Nice, we're down to one. Now, you notice that I got 2750 experience, so it's obvious that boring beetles are a lot tougher than than the bitter bugs. Okay. So let's 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 cast a couple. Let's cast a good heal wounds here. Let's. Ca Ooh, that that wasn't really a great heal wounds spell. So. We're going to rest here and hope that hope that nothing happens, hope we don't get any encounters. rest-wise, but... Okay. Ah, so I'm in another room. yippee ti yay -yay. creeping cruds. We're not sure, you know, we, they could be model cruds or they could be something worse. So, unfortunately, these don't have a lot of hit points. So that, that's, that's the good part about these. a spell on them, but I don't, I think they're pretty resistant to wind spells, which blows, get it, wind blows. Yeah, they, they probably were model cruds. Let's, let's see if we've been this way before. Okay, so let's look it at it. Oh, okay, no, we haven't, so we're going to just... Let's cast a good heal wounds.
okay. Another another encounter. Let's see what it is. Whoa. Now, blackbirds don't give you a whole lot of experience. And so my goal is hopefully I can hide and then run. Oh, okay, I got lucky to hide. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna I'm gonna try to run. This is cause, you know, with with this many monster groups, you know, ideally what you want, you want there's there's a there's some group spells that come up later, you know, really big group spells where you're like, eh. Um there's a few spells that you can cast that will affect multiple multiple groups, but until I get one of those, if I have like a lot of multiple group multiple groups, I'm I'm gonna try and run. So let's let's do that. Okay, so I ran away. Let's see let's see where I ended up. Okay, so, so I'm just going to turn myself back around. Now I'm probably, if that now, it depends on whether the birds were either a set or a random encounter. If they were a set encounter, then I'm going to get another encounter here. If they were random, then I may or may not. Well, we're going to, let's see. Yep, they, they were a set encounter. Oh, cool, we got some eerie moths. Got some eerie moths, okay. Ooh, this could be a while. Now, the eerie moth, ooh, now one thing about the D Forte mod is that if, let's say, you hide and you get, like, put to sleep, it, it actually unhides you. And unfortunately, that was it's a little bit nice, but that's kind of like a um, a loophole. See, now I'm unhidden, and so I'm I'm now exposed to their attacks. So he's noticed it says I hid in the shadows. Okay, I'm going to see if I can't whirlwind these. I don't know if I can, but I'll try. Oh, not bad, actually. I, actually, I think I killed a couple of them. See three glow moss. Let's go after them. I've already damaged some of them, so maybe I can damage a few more. At least they don't do a lot of damage. That's the good part. Okay. So again, let's hide. Unfortunately, now I'm no longer hidden. Okay, so let's get back to hiding again. And remember, even if you're hidden, you can still be hit by, spe you know, spell attacks or, you know, or like breath. 
So like for example, if you're fighting dragons and they breathe, yep. Okay, good, good Moody, got down to four. So let's, let's get hidden again. Let's see if we can't get rid of this last glow moth. Okay, better hide again. Hopefully none of us will try to put him to put me to sleep. Okay, let's let's cast a heal wounds. I need to I need to heal up, so let's do that. Okay. So let's get rid of this one right here. Okay, good. So can I hide again? Let's let's keep on doing this little it's kind of game of hide and seek, you know. Okay. I'm trying to debate. Yeah, oh boy, okay. Probably probably should at least ca cast a bless. Just to maybe help help with help with um help with with um um with hitting and um not taking as much damage. Okay, be more talkative, Moody. Okay. So here we go again. Really? Okay, so now now we're asleep. And it's likely the okay, good. We got lucky there. It's a lot of times the only way you get a way woke up is okay, so one of them's still knocked out, which is good. Source. We're now we're, we're in the we're on the second level of the beginner dungeon. Okay, so now we're down to two. This has been a tough battle. I'll tell you what. You know. As I said, I'm not really grinding here. I'm actually trying. You know, I'm. You know, I'm actually trying to move move the. Not really moving the storyline along, but you know, completing the beginner dungeon is good. I have my reasons for it. Now, so there we got almost 5,000 experience points, so that, that's probably why I had a lot of trouble with that fight. thousand more XP. So let's save it often. Uh, let's see. Ooh, there that, that's we we need that. We wanna really get we wanna really get our um um hit points back because and our spell points. Okay. 
Let's see, am I going to be left asleep? Okay, no, it at least allowed me to wake up. Of course, I hope that these aren't like these, um, like the stronger bugs. Just, I'm going to, I'm going to whirlwind them just because I can. Oh, okay, they, they were like the bitter bugs, so I didn't, I probably, it probably was overkill, but... I'd rather better safe than sorry, you know, I'd rather be like, I'd rather be a little bit more powerful than, okay, so I think I'm pretty good where I want to be, yep, everything's topped off. Horror of Recepretep. Okay. Don't know if I really want to go in there. Okay, you know. Okay. Okay. So... You pause for a moment to reflect, reflect upon the wisdom of disturbing whatever it is that might be beyond that gate. Well, it's only one way to find out, y'all. Guess what? We're going, we're going in. Okay, so here we go. We're going to save it. Okay. There's going to be an ad break soon, so a sudden flash of fire rises from the sconces along the wall as you enter the chamber and dancing in the flicker of their candlelight, you watch as a shadowy form emerges from the depths of a smoky, bubbly pool. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, boy. Okay. <sighs> okay, so to say this is not going to be fun is going to be an understatement. Now there is going to be an ad break coming up soon. I'm just letting y'all know. Uh, okay, so. Uh, let's 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 get a plan going here. Let's get a plan going. First, let's just hide. Now the rat the 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 rat -ta -ta, the ratatouilles they can um, they can cast spells, okay? They didn't, but they can. Okay. So let's see. Well, the 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 Rasa the Rasa Ratep, I don't know how to pronounce that. I'll just is um, fortunately they are they look like skeletons. So we're gonna try we're gonna try to dispel undead on them. We're not gonna do anything with the the night rooks yet. The night rooks they can't cast spells. So, we're just going to see if we can get rid of them.
Okay, I'm waiting for the, I'm gonna, just gonna, my, my thing shows an ad break in progress, it uh, just started, so I'm just going to do that. Okay, there's an ad break going on, so I'm kind of just like, you know, not doing much of anything. I'm just relaxing, just chilling, chilling like a villain. Okay, so the ad break is over. I'm going to um, go back. Uh, let's get back to the game. Let's, uh, okay, so now, now, so one of the reasons I became a priest, in the game that is okay and not in real life, but because of two words, dispel undead. I mean, that honestly, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go after these night rooks with the whirlwind spell. And we did some decent damage, okay? One thing I do know about night rooks is they can they can hit pretty hard. I'm just I'm gonna rest. I'm gonna do a little resting. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see if what happens is what I think happens. Cause I don't know about this mod, but I know in the original game night rooks tended to flee a lot. Night rooks tended to like to flee. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna protect myself. I'm gonna do a few of these and get myself protected. So Okay, maybe one more, one more protection. Hey, D Forte, I'm doing great. How are you doing? Okay, so let's. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna do some fairy dust on the one on the group that I did no damage to. And they're all asleep. Good. So while they're asleep, I'm going to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna attack these. By the way, I better give give a shout out to D Forte for the uh, for 
Duarte, who's was very very responsible for my, um, you know, my my enjoying playing playing the mod. It's okay. I'm gonna hide again. Darn it! Those night rooks just woke up like like that. It's all right. We can put him back to sleep again. You're welcome. Glad, glad to, sh glad to shout you out. Okay, let's go after these three night rooks again. Um, I've already loosened them up. I've already. Loosen them up a little, uh, damage them a little bit by, okay, by, uh, by, by whirlwinding them. Okay. Gonna hide again. Again, night rooks are not to be messed with. Um, so I'm going to, fair, I'm gonna put them to sleep again. We love, I love putting, you know. I'm gonna now see these night rooks I did not damage so okay and eh, let's let's not sleep okay let's not sleep and, and gl glad to shout yeah I mean it's 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 your mod that I'm pl I'm playing and it's going it, it's going um. Swim, swimmingly well. Wait a minute. Swimmingly well, maybe really. Let's see. Do we have anything? Uh, we can at least cast a hypnotize, and that'll that'll at least, I think, pa paralyze one of them, which is good. That's at least, that'll at least give us a little bit of help. We're no longer hidden. Darn it! But thank you for coming on in, D Forte. I loved, loved your loved your wizard, wizardry eight um, eight stream that you um, that you did this evening. I'm probably gonna stream you a couple more times, probably Friday and Saturday. And then I may then I may just take a little a break for a little bit. Well, I think you know I think you know why I'm I'm st I'm uh, doing a fairy. I th I, th I think you know. I think I think you know the three items that I'm that I'm interested that I'm wanting. <laughs> Wow, I was get I was getting hit there, so I better better be careful a little bit. Better be careful. Better at least put him. Well, oh boy, I don't know. I really want to put him to sleep, but on the other hand, who? I want to save. I want to save that powder for later. Well, okay. So now they're all asleep. So now it's time to. Okay, only one's awake, so I'm gonna go for it. Now, if you know my luck, what's going to happen is, knowing my luck is one of them, like the last one that goes after me is going to paralyze me or something. Let's see. Ooh, I only have two fairy dusts, so I better... Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a little. I'm gonna do some he wound healing. Okay, that 
helped. So let's do a hypnotize. That's that. Hopefully, it will at least paralyze one of them. So that's one less night night rook that's going to attack me. Oh, good. Okay, good. We're going to hide again. Um, prob I actually have not as much as I probably should. You know what? Thank thank you for the idea. Thank thank you for the idea. Thank you for the idea. Eh. Let's let's fight. Let's fight. I'm Whoa, that was tough. Let's, let's go for it again. Nice! Down to one! Let's do another loot of iron skin and then we're gonna finish off this bird brain. Uh, let's do a hypnotize. hit points. I can't believe that the rook is still alive. Well, let's do another beholden. Let's do another, I mean, hypnotize, excuse me. Okay, so we're gonna gonna finish the night rook off. Wow, 7,000 XP. Okay, we found a ring. We found some powder. So I'm going to take these. And I am going to immediately... The skeleton ghoul now... Splintered into hundreds of tiny bones. You nevertheless feel uneasy about the mythical chamber and could almost swear the little ivory fragments were slowly inching their way back into the pool. Okay, I just, I put a question for you, DeForte, feel free to answer it, you don't have to, but, so I'm wondering if, let's say I cast it three times, do I get triple the effect, or is it a case of where, where I only get, you know, I only get that, you know, that once. But thank you for coming on in, I pre appreciate the, the support. Uh, let's also do configuration so I know that. Okay, resume play. Okay, thank you. Thank you for letting me know. So I only know. I, I still may cast it multiple times because I want to show you all something. If you look under music, I'm already up to 10. I'm up to 10 music because of, of mul multiple cat multiple uses of the, the instrument. Um, my nin ninjutsu is already at 100. I'm only level 8. Um, I'm hoping to get some other weapons. 
And of course I've got four diplomacy because uh, because of uh, encountering some uh, enco encountering some NPCs. And the, interesting when I encountered the NPCs when grinding, um, every time they got angry, they attacked me. Every time they, you know, and so if, if you want to get diplomacy, the NPCs have to be pleased. Well, I'm going to, I'm going to rest. I need to rest. I need, I need to rest. I am, I am beat. So, ooh, there's a chest here. Okay. So what I probably should do is heal up just to make sure in case this chest has something in it that's not good, that I'm good. Okay, so... I actually have a decent skull skullduggery, so let's see if I can disarm the trap. Oh, lots of yellow and red, which... What happens is, so yellow means that... that I don't set the trap off. But I at least found out something about it, at least... Okay, so... So this, there's, this is definitely in it. So what I call position number eight. Ooh, guardian, boy. Are we ready for death number 11? Oops, guardian. A demonic force appears. Moody is attacked. Moody takes 13 damage. Moody is battered about. Oh. Moody dies. <laughs> the demonic force smiles. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Hey, let's increase increase the death counter. And by the way, I, I think I've seen, so that's why some streamers, when they say um, guardian on a chest, they don't walk, they run. Now, unfortunately, I, I, need, I need to get probably a knock-knock spell, or at least a knock-knock scroll, so let's try this again. We could be here a while, y'all, so... Make some popcorn and again a demonic force appears. Moody is attacked. That that's not the bag big deal. Whew. Thank you. Thank you, demonic force, for not 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 a batter me about. I got a book. Ooh, I got an amulet. Ooh, goodies, goody, goody. My goodies. Ooh, we got some. Ooh, yeah, thanks. Okay, so let's. I definitely want that. I want the potions. I want the book. I want the amulet. I want the scroll. Um, reagent would be nice. I, bullets are nice, but I'm not gonna like lose any sleep over that. Okay. Ooh, I'm full. 
So another word, yeah, thank you, thank, thank you, I did get lucky. Now, so one thing I'm going to do is, so, so you see my uh, swimming ability is, is 11. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the water. Look at how much my um, stamina went down. So when you have when you have relatively low swimming, every time you swim, your your, your stamina is going to go a bit down. Now my swimming increased to 12. Um, there is there is a, there is a formula for how how much the swimming goes down by. Oh, re-entering the chamber, you note that most of the bone fragments have disappeared. As you start to leave the crypt. You deliberately step out of your way to grind a small remaining finger chip into the floor. <laughs> okay. So now what I'm gonna do, so let's let's look at my So I actually have decent um exp um I, I don't need a lot of experience for my for my next level up. Uh what I'm gonna do is I don't know about y'all. I'm I'm, ma I'm making a beeline for the fountain, okay? I'm making a beeline for the fountain. You know, I'm getting the heck, I'm, and because there's a couple reasons for making a, a fountain be ooh, five bugs, two bugs, two bugs. Okay, let's hope I can hide. Good. I'm not sure what type of bugs these are. I'm, I'm not sure what types of bugs these are, but... But what I'm going to do, I'm, I'm just, I'm going to run. I'm, I'm going I'm to get, I'm going to get out of dodge. You know, sometimes, y'all, what you need to do is you just need to run. You know, and there's no shame in that, okay? There's no shame in saying, hey, I need to get out of Dodge. Okay, which way did I come in originally? Okay, here we go, it's that way. So, Um, I could if I wanted to explore some of the other, some of the side passages, but I'm not going to because I'm interested in getting back here. Because, because what I have is I have a whole, I have a whole bunch of items to, I've got a whole bunch of cool items I want to identify. Um... So let's let's start casting some spells. Let's start casting identify. Ooh, cracker sticks, nice. Energy, ooh, level three energy blast, sweet. Okay. So let's see what's next. We've got powder. Ooh, failure, darn. Let, let's see if we can't use the remaining light heal. That's all right. We've got some other light heals. We can merge these. Okay. So the powders probably may be, may be something more advanced. So we're going to just gonna relax here a little bit. We're gonna, gonna just okay. Let's let's go let's go for the ring. Let's do a let's do a level four on the ring. Ring of protection. 
protection, okay. Ooh. Minus one to armor class, don't say if I do. Okay, so. So now you notice the negative one here, that, that, that's, this is, so now my dodge armor class is plus six. Uh, but I have a ne I'm wearing a magic item that has a negative one. Uh, that's giving me negative one, which is the ring of protection. Okay. So let's go back here again. And I'm also lucky in that if I get any monsters uh, during my encounters. Let's see what the book is. Okay, detect secrets. Ooh, cool, I can use it. Okay, so, gonna, gonna, gonna do a fun experiment here. I'm gonna get back all of my hit points. Okay, now. So, my, my uh, let's see. So, let's scribe it. What? What do you mean? Oh, crap. I saw the P, and I thought that P in the middle was for priest, but that's for psionic. Ah. Okay, so, alright, let's, let's do a uh, level 5 identify on the powder. Whoa! Damn! Skeleton powder, ooh. No wonder we couldn't identify it with, like, a, reg a regular spell. I thought it was just, like, boring, like, um, sleep powder or something, yeah. Wow. Damn. And D Forte, thank you for letting me know that Armor Shield doesn't stack. That way. Okay, so let's now let's now go after the bullets. Spike stones, not bad. Not too bad. Okay, so we're we, we There is an ad break coming up, so um, sometimes, though, the time it, which it tells me is coming up and when it actually starts is a little bit off. So I have, a, I have a feeling I think it's probably due to how long the ad actually is. So... See, see, it says that there's the ad break has started, but no, it's not starting on my end of it. Uh, let's, let's do one more. Let's see, okay, so got an amulet here. Let's, let's go with the full-blown identify on the amulet. Ooh, amulet of life, now. For me, uh, for a single character playthrough, it's not that big of a deal. But you know what? I'm going to say it is. You know why? Because I bet you someone will give me, 
Yes, I, I bet you someone will give me big bucks for that. So, time for me to take a break during the ad break. back everyone ad break is over I just want to thank everyone who's been watching you know th thanks thanks for the support and I better okay I better get my um, spell points back again so I can identify more things okay. so reagent I'm gonna go full-blown identifying this reagent Okay, so we've got Dragon's Teeth, which has 30% magic resistance. I'm going to hold on to it, but I don't know if, I mean, because I, I like the fact that the Ring of Protection does, does help my, um, does help my, um, uh, what I call, what we call Dodge Armor class. I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about armor class for a little bit. Okay. Now ooh, I like that. I like that knockdown. Now I'm trying to remember which it has a four and a four. Now the the good thing about the D Forte mod is it's set up so that all, uh, that all scrolls have four uses, not just one, but four. Uh, they're also, and they also, I think most of them are on power level four, so. Which is a nice feature. I am not selling this. I'm keeping this because we can use this. We can, we can use this in uh, helping to use this in helping to, you know, open up chests. Okay. So. So let's... Really? Really stupid chair. Okay, so let's go back to the um, fountain. Sweet. Okay. Let's see how much we need to level up. 12,000? Hmm. Okay. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm going for it. I'm, um, the, the 
one pl okay, so we already know about Palookas, okay? So let's let's find a place to drop this. Now see we have a bunch of things over there, so I'm just gonna drop this here. That's the tarnished mail and the tarnished sword. What we're doing is I'm actually getting I'm actually fixing to go to go to go to New City. Now, one thing if you remember about New City, there is a certain place where you get ambushed by rats. Despite all my rage, I am still just a rat in a cage. I'm oh, sorry. Okay. Now, Normally I would not do anything. Normally I wouldn't go, but I think I have enough stuff, enough stuff that I can throw at them. That I can throw at the rats. Because what we got here, so let's see, what do we got? We've got cracker sticks, which which will do a lot of damage. We've got skeleton powder insta-kill. Um, we've got a loot of iron skin. So what we're gonna do, okay, so. The forest grows thick along the roadway here, a perfect place for <gasps> ambush. Uh-oh. Let's see how bad it is. Okay, ooh boy. We've got nine ratkins, eight ratkins, nine ratkins, six T rang youngers. Now, you notice that there the nine the first line has a nine with an exclamation point. That means that at least one of the ratkins is hidden. I'm what I'm probably gonna do is honestly I am going to hide and probably run. I mean, you know, as as as, as much, you know, as as good as good as I am, four groups like this is probably too much for a single character. So we're gonna run. Oh, great! Moody runs blocked. Moody runs blocked. Moody runs blocked. Oh, and now, now the second row of Rackin says, "Hey, let's also hide." Now, if o if only I had my scroll of nuclear blast, this this would already have already been over. So, what I'm probably gonna, let me just I'm gonna try to run two more times, and if it doesn't work, then I'm just going to. Okay, so uh, let's let's start throwing cracker sticks. Okay, let's 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 keep throwing cracker sticks. Let's do it again. Okay, 
let's let's throw another cracker stick. We'll see what happens. Ooh, fizzle. It probably fizzled because we're we're terrible at artifacts. That being said, we are kind of getting some artifact training by throwing the sticks, but I have a feeling what's going to happen is once I run out of sticks, I'm going to actually have to do melee, and let's just let's just say it's not going to be good. Okay, I'll do, do. Okay, wow. Even the rogues are high. Yeah, okay. <laughs> And I'll be honest with you, I don't know if you're still here, DeForte, but I, I love the fact that you allow like b bandits and ro enemy rogues to hide. I, just, I like it just because it's like, you know, if they're a thief, that's one of the thieves' abilities. Thieves can hide. You know, it's... it's You know, I, rem I remember play. I remember a good DM that that um that sometimes would give us like a low level low level character characters access to magic weapons, but the caveat was that the mo like the uh, that monster that you were fighting could use that. So if let's say there was like a plus, let's say you were getting a plus plus one long sword. Let's say there was a plus one longsword available. It wasn't hidden away in a treasure chest. It was actually the monster was using it. And see, that that's what I like. Let's try a skeleton powder. Oh, okay, cool. Uncool. That only works against one character. Well, I think that's what death was supposed to be anyway, but still, come on. It's like... <laughs> okay, another fizzle. Wow. yippee ti yay -yay. I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna melee and we'll see what happens. I have a feeling that it's not going to last much longer just because of the, the the sheer numbers, but I just I just don't see I just don't see my winning. Okay, I don't see my winning against if if it was like a single or double, uh, only two groups, I probably could get away with it. But the fact that we had like about thirty of them, you know, thirty means that probably I'm going to be. My, yep, my head's going to be served up for breakfast. Oh. Yep. Okay. Updated to death counter. So here we go again. We're going to try this again. This is uh, still four groups. Um, still four groups, but I'm a, I'm 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 not saying I'm a lot more. Wait, wait a minute, Moody. You forgot, darn it, you forgot about, let's see, let's see what you got here, you got the ring of protection, fairy dust, uh, okay, let's do at least a loot of iron skin, even though it's probably, you know, I mean, against all of these. Okay, let's let's start let's start putting the um, cracker sticks on the T-Rang. Whoa!
Good thing we were hidden, because that was a backfire. And a fizzle. Okay. Oh, we're 0 for 2. <laughs> I was about to say that. I was about to say I'm really considering a name change to failure. <laughs> Let's try to hit you with a whirlwind and see how many of you that kills. None. Great. Seriously, priest? Now there's two possibilities here. If if I if I keep striking out here, what I'll probably do, I'll probably have to do some off-screen grinding to level up the priest a little bit, maybe get some more uh, you know, maybe some more powerful spells. Um, that may, that's one possibility, or I may have to just keep plugging and get lucky. Okay, up. To, uh, here we go. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't going to do that, but once the third backfire came, I'm like, no. Here your 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 name new name is failure, okay? Deal with it. <laughs> Priest can earn back the real name later. But again, it's like a little bit high expectations. They want three artifacts? Really? You think you think that three artifacts is gonna be like, oh yeah. Okay, we're gonna try this again. Let's hope we don't get four more groups, okay? Now normally I would I would I would grind here but So you see we got tw 11 25 characters 
25 monsters, even if we hit perfectly. No, I don't want to cheat them. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to do my usual. I'm just going to, if I think I'm defeated, I'm just going to melee my way through it and just say, hey, you know, that's the way it is. Yeah, Jimmy Colorado, he'd be saying, she to win. I know Jimmy, if Jimmy were here, probably saying, hey, this is this is this is this is how you can hex edit. Yeah, this is what you need to do in order to hex edit this so you don't have to worry about you know what. Let's go after the T-Rang Youngers. And see the problem here is that there's so many there's so many monsters is that once you're exposed cuz you, if you hide once you once you hit something uh, Okay. We're now at 14 deaths. I'm going to do this one um So let's try this again. Let's hope we don't get four monster groups. Two is ideal. Two monster groups, ideal. If we get two monster groups, I think we have a chance. I can I can see I can see where you're coming from. So this is what we're gonna do. Let's let's see if we can run again. Let's see if they'll let us run. Probably won't, but you know, darn it. Really. Okay, I have I have a I have a feeling I have a feeling that we're we're prob we're probably at an impasse. Ooh. <laughs> oh. 
It was even funny because failure got actually got knocked out. Hmm. What to do? What to do? Okay. Let's see what I've got here. See what to do. I'm I'm still trying to think. What to, what do I want to do? You know. <sighs> let's see. Let's let's keep. Let's let's do this one more time. See what happens. Yep. So what I'm gonna do. Is I'm just, I'm gonna I'm gonna I hate to do this, oh. but I'm gonna abandon. I'm gonna count that. I'm gonna count that as a death. That's saying you know, hey you, you know, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go I'm gonna go back into the beginner dungeon, and I'm I'm gonna do just a little bit more grinding. I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna do on screen grinding until about two, until about two hours in, and then what I'm gonna then what I'm gonna do is prob probably end the stream unless I get raided, and then we're gonna do some off screen grinding. I just got an idea. Just got an idea. There is an ad break coming up soon. And it's probably going to be the last ad break because unless unless the viewership goes goes way up, I'm going to um Uh, I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna call it about 15 20 minutes or so Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm not sure about about the types of monsters in this area. So I'm just going to hang out here. And see if maybe we can't get a monster that may be able to give us a decent weapon. Well, we got some foots. I don't know. I don't know what the foots are gonna be, be like.
Okay, thank you for D Forte. Thank you. I'm uh, I I, pre I appreciate the love and pro I'll probably be streaming the next two evenings with your mods. So thank you very much. Okay, ad break is over. I'm now back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going we're going to we're going to do some more um I'm going to be grinding. Um grinding again, but And by the way, you may some of you may wonder why I've why my character is now renamed Failure. It's because they backfired. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some grinding. I'm not sure what ca what type of monsters I'm going to be up against, but I'm hoping to get some that will will drop treasure, will drop some uh, weapons, especially weapons that a priest can use. would be nice but we'll see what happens uh, right now I'm probably going to go about another 10 or 15 minutes and then call it an evening that is unless I get raided or something hey if I get raided I'll be like Okay, it's a Bambi food, so that means we're probably not going to get much of anything from it. Yep, not much. So here we go again. We're just going to go round and round, round and round. Okay. I'm not sure if these are night rooks or dragon rooks. Or no not night rooks or or ravens. If they're ravens there's not gonna be a lot of XP. If there's night rooks there's a little bit more XP available. But that's alright. Oh cr really? Flying away, sheesh. Really, birds? Yep, they're ravens, so even if we kill both of them, the mo we're going to get 220 whopping experience points, which on grinding, that's not good, okay? The goal of grinding is to get XP. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to go back to the beginner dungeon. Okay, I've got a full, got a full, got a full you know what, so let's. So we're gonna, we're gonna grind here because it's like okay. So what I'll do is at least with the one group of ravens I'll do whirlwind so I may be able to kill some of them. And that way I'll at least get the experience XP for them. Now I'm just going to give you a tip on uh, grinding tip. 
So let's say let's say you're let's say you're playing a game and you're wanting to get, get X XP. All, all, all I'm gonna suggest is cut cut the lead cut the delay down. Just make it as quick as possible, especially if you're grinding off stream. Now I actually have on Wizardry One I actually have done some on screen grinding, but. I tell people, hey, this is a grinding stream, you know? And so what I would do, often do is I'd be like, instead of like concentrating on gameplay, I'd probably give my commentary on on things like, oh yeah, you know, blah, blah, blah. You know, I'd be like, oh yeah, let's, let's talk about the latest news. Um... Just a suggestion, y'all. Just a suggestion on streaming, unless you specifically say it's a political stream. Don't do don't don't talk about politics on stream. As you may say, wait a minute, I, I, I dislike such and such a politician. But if you if you look at most of the presidential elect... Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not going to speak. If you look at most of the presidential elections, most of them, with a very few exceptions, w very rarely was out of the 60-40 realm. So in other words, maybe the president won like by like 51, 47. And so a lot of the presidential elections were pretty tight. So that means that you're, ooh, I like this. I like this. Like this a lot. Like this a lot. Four bugs, four bugs, three bugs, because. Okay. Let's, I'm going to hit the, this group of bugs. Let's hit them with a whirlwind. Okay. And so I'm actually going to focus on this group of bugs. Actually, no, I'm not because they're out of my range. Okay, right now I'm looking for someone to raid, but I'm not really seeing anyone, you know, I'm not really, not really seeing anyone to raid, you know, just gonna... So unless I get raided, this is probably this is probably gonna be the last encounter, okay? And so what I'm gonna do when I start grind, um, when I grind, I'm gonna essentially the the pause is gonna be nothing. I'm just going to be sound is turned off, and I'm just gonna be like poo 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 poo. -poo. I just want to thank everyone that came by. D Forte, thank you for dropping on in. You know, again, this is, you, you, I'm going to say you did a you did an excellent job of the mo of your mod. It's very. It's 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 it's. it's I'll say this. It's ba It's balanced it more. It's. You know, because I'll be honest with you, I'm one of those that I look at games, and I and I like oh I if I'm gonna want to win a game, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna exploit loopholes. So that's why almost every time when I played Wizardry, you know there was a, there was a Valkyrie there because. 
is I was like, hey, I can I can get the best of both worlds. I can cast three spells and I can be a darn good fighter. And you, the Forte's mod's like, okay, now we're gonna balance it. You can still have the best of bo both worlds, but you're only gonna get a spell every other level. And so that kind of is like, wait a minute, now you need to think. And so that's why I went for a priest. Because I know a priest would get spells pretty quickly. A priest would like get spells every, every level rather than on like a Valkyrie every other level. Now, priests, were they the best fighters? Not really, but they're, they're still decent. I'm going to be honest with you. They're still decent. Really? I'll tell you what, failure is like... Oh. Okay, I'll tell you what. I want to thank everyone for watching. Um, I'm right now going to call it a night. I'm going to call it a night. And let's see. Let's see who's out there. Is there anyone cool that we can raid? Oh boy, okay. Actually, I do see some, ooh. Oh, actually I do see someone I want to raid. Hesh Hesh Ballantine. Let's ra let's raid Hesh Ballantine. Let's let's raid them. They're they're playing. They're I think they're playing Ultima Six. Let me just check to make sure that they're playing what I think they're playing before I raid them. Oh yep. Okay. Good. So let's raid them. <laughs> 